But we begin this morning with that breaking news. A teenager hit and killed. Thank you for joining us. I'm Andy Sirota. Good morning. I'm Tania Wright. That teen has now been identified as Tyrese Maningo. The 14-year-old was killed as he was attempting to cross Highway 321 right near Dayton High School. Channel 2's Vincent Crivelli live right now on the scene. So, Vincent, we do know that teen was a student at Woodrow Wilson Junior High School. That's right, such a tragic situation. This teenager was on their way to school when they were struck by a vehicle here on Highway 321. Authorities have been on scene for over three hours as the investigation into this deadly accident continues. In the middle of the road, a mangled bicycle. The metal twisted from the impact. At 6.45 this morning, 14-year-old Tyrese Meningo was on his way to Woodrow Wilson Junior High School when he was struck by a vehicle. The eighth grader was pronounced deceased on scene. Authorities are investigating the deadly crash, conducting accident reconstruction as a drone is in the air, taking pictures and making measurements. The scene stretches nearly a quarter of a mile, debris scattered throughout. Dayton ISD released a statement. It says in part, our thoughts and prayers are with the family and friends of our student. There are additional grief counselors on campus to assist students and staff to help deal with the loss of our young Bronco. And the driver of the vehicle remained on scene and is cooperating with police. Now authorities say at this time they do not expect to file criminal charges. Reporting live in Liberty County, Vincent Crivelli, KPRC, Channel 2 News.